And welcome back to the horrible silence that is the Forsaken Maiden. I'm your favorite PNG of a fox, Yuki Kiki, today. And this place is really quiet. Like, really quiet. Before I forget, this is a new session. We gotta turn on uh, our fast uh, card here, X. I, I know there's no audio. I'm sorry that there's no music. The game's quiet because it's all serious. Okay, our game speed fast. I should really do this before I start videos, but you know, whatever. Alrighty. I have a feeling that this might be very close to the end of the game here. Because uh, this is being pretty serious. We're going to go outside and it's going to be darkness or some nonsense. <laughs> could this be the finale? It could be. The sea falls eerily still. Almost as if afraid of something. Yeah, I don't like how quiet it is. It's you not, not cool. You realize that the strange energy you felt earlier is not only in the spire, but blankets the entire aisle, feeling a tap on your shoulder. Oh, Laddie. You turn to see Laddie as pale as a sheet. She like points in the distance like a giant monster. She points. Yep. And when you turn to see her, she's <laughs> yep, staring at Of course at she is. You find ah, the field of that's a sea monster. By a monster so big that it pierces the clouds. That's a sea monster. It's raging toward you. Tearing through the sea as it does, you can't believe That's your eyes. But you know you can't stand still. We have to evacuate. Oh, this is the real world again, right? I, I totally forgot. Then make for the village. Okay. Ah, uh, that's annoying. <laughs> we go to the village, be like, "Hey, uh, guys, did you notice? Did you notice that there's a giant sea monster in the distance?" Just, just curious. Anyone notice that? So the beast to end it all has finally reared its head. The old man remarks, calm despite the impending danger. It seems very casual about the fact that there's a giant monster rushing towards the village to like consume us all. Aside from the odd crying child, nothing seems amiss in the village. I. <laughs> Nobody seems the slightest bit bothered by the monster. Does no one care about the giant sea monster running towards Omega us? Omega Village, which has been without a maiden for years, seems overly accepting of its fate. Yeah, the Omega Village is full of a bunch of Omegas. Da, 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 da. You decide to speak with the mayor to God, learn no, how you serious. might evacuate the people. You only hope he can be swayed. Yeah, they're like, we don't want to evacuate. Why do we evacuate? We want to be destroyed. We love beacons. Can I jump still? Yeah, I can jump now. Cool. Um, item shop feels kind of important. Same with accessory shop. But let's take a hot look at these other stores. Just, just because there's a giant sea monster. So, you know, maybe consider buying something else. You know, I'm pretty sure the sea monster might use some water. <laughs> I I maybe would consider buying a water resist ring. Uh, poison stay, freeze this ray. What do we, what do we do? Uh, curse day, life. What's life do again? Uh, regen three at the start of every turn, which isn't terrible, but not the best. Uh, increase crit, increase invasion. Mm. I feel like this thing is going to use water attacks on us, but I, I don't feel like anything would be helpful here. Uh, other, not, no, 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 not that way. The other store. I'm a, I'm a little concerned about the giant sea monster, unlike everyone else in this goddamn village, but you know. Um, is this, that that's my current weapon. Um, do we have anything? Nice halberd sounds amazing. Do we want to lower our defense to like nothing? That sounds amazing. Be super slow and have just massive attack. Have higher armor. Let's buy a nice halberd. That 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 sounds good. What can I buy and equip? Or is it just so it's just a weird color? Uh, I say equip this. It's going to be nothing but high damage. All right, perfect. Okay. Uh, armors. What do we got? We have frost mail, which she's using. I could lower my speed to four. Uh, is there a better armor? We can raise her attack. Well, we have martialists. Or we could increase our armor. Wait, this one's better. This one's six. So I could raise my armor by mildly raising uh, that and making my speed still absolute garbage. Hmm. 
Does the speed truly matter at this point? I'm not sure it does. I thought we just go all in on like attack. That that sounds reasonable. I wonder who this person is I haven't met. Who are you? Just some lady. I'll keep living my life as I always have until the very end, she declares as she goes about cleaning the village. I see. No one really cares about this, huh? That's that's cool. Um I don't know what she do with the rings. I feel like it might be a water monster, but I don't want to spend all my money on like water stuff. Just in the off chance it's not a water monster. So we have two frost mail, I think, though, right? We have at least one frost mail. Um, what's some items? Somebody to heal me. Um, superior. Buy a couple. I have five already. Jeez, buy fewer. Let's just have seven of those. Where's our inspirations? Uh, the pan, the pan, the pancreas, uh, pansia, pansia. Pan uh, panacea, panacea would be great. Uh, is there a revive all, by the way? I've, I've never actually checked. There is a bomb, apparently. I wasn't aware that was a thing. Um, how many revives do we have? None. Buy a lot more of those. Just, just a ton more. Uh, at least five. Because I have to fight a giant sea monster. <laughs> uh, just get rid of everything. Yes, please. I, I can't imagine we get, like, frozen, like, four times in a row, but, you know. <coughs> Horrible cough. Um. I'm preparing because I figure I'm going to have to fight a giant sea monster, so. It's been ages since you've seen oh, grief. Man. How are you? And yet he averts his eyes cool name. the moment you enter. Hey, Grief, I brought you your daughter. I think we fixed her maiden powers. Just like the other villagers. He seems to have accepted his fate. We killed like a bunch of other maidens and took their power. And I think she's kind of strong now. Well, I mean, we forgot to kill one, but you know, besides that, we killed the rest of them. You have so much to ask him. What do you say? Um. What the hell's that monster? <laughs> you ask the mayor about the giant monster. He says it is called the Isle Eater. Um, so considering the other island also lost its maidens, uh, well, the. The, the white one uh, has, like, infinite maidens, but, like, the, the black one uh, is not doing great, and theirs is dead. So, is it also going to be eaten? According to the maiden's myth, the calamitous beast has appeared since times of old to devour islands. I see. I suppose that's my problem, right? So why are you just waiting you for this? ask him why everyone is stubbornly just waiting for everything to come to an end. Because that is this village's fate. Grief answers simply. But what if I brought you a maiden that could save your village? What if I just killed him? We could just kill it. Like, we don't need maiden. Let's just kill you the You ask him if there is a way to evacuate the village. But he tells you there is no way off the island. Are you not aware I have a boat? Like, I've been traveling. You have learned nothing for all your effort. Like <laughs> Perhaps feeling the same. Laddie rushes to the village entrance. I guess they don't know about the Riku sucks, but whatever. That's you ignore sucks Grief, to be them. Who tries to stop you both and chase after Laddie? What it if, seems what unlikely if we escape? that the villagers will flee the island, which leaves you with no choice but to slay the monster yourselves. Come here, Laddie. What if we just abandon the village that hates you and we go to a different village? The the Azure one seemed kind of nice. We could go there. Azure one's a good option. The, the swamp one sucks, the ivory's a little crazy, but like... Head up from sea, from that I could throw the monster. Sounds terrible. Ah, uh, I vote we save here in case we need to buy more things. That's that's a good idea, right? Just have a backup option here. Um, I don't like that we have like no armor. We have, we have a lot of attack. So I hope it's weak to fire. Hey, Sea Monster, how are you? I can't jump. Hello, Mr. Sea Monster. You and Laddie board the Bon Vaughn and point the prow toward the Isle Eater. <gasps> Our shabby little Riku sucks is going to have to fight this giant monster, huh? Ah, oh, boy. The calamitous beast towers before you. It's like a feather on its head. It's kind of fun. realize that there was truth to the myth. To what? save the village, you have no yes, choice Baron. but to fight it. 
here and now. You, you can see it. It's clearly there. You it's... know it's reckless, but still grip your sword tightly. Uh, conveniently, I'm actually equipping a sword this time, so we're good. We've come to help. Oh my god, it's the maiden in red. Oh my god, they're alive. I forgot about them. A light flashes in the sky, and two figures appear. <laughs> the crimson maiden, Lavia, and her attendant, Gladia, I... from Hero's Dominion. I, I generally thought, like, after they just swapped the thing, like, maybe she died off, like, off screen somewhere because all the rest of them died. Maybe this one didn't die. Well, we're gonna feed this one to a sea monster, so let's go. They claim to have seen the monster during a trade expedition and rushed over. How kind of you. You were joined unexpectedly by the Crimson Maiden and her attendant. With them, you may be able to save the island from disaster. Wait, don't you have a broken attack, too? You make for the monster's Ooh. head and raise your sword up to the sky. Uh, can I give you guys rings? That'd be really... No? Okay, cool. The fight is on. Uh, tentacles. Tentacles are monster. Ah, oh, it's, it's, oh, it's so cool. It, it's one of those multiple part cards. That's so nice. Right. Not a riddle. Attack up! Hells yeah. Oh god, it has attack up. It's gonna kill me in one hit. Um... 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 Uh, generate, right? I just need more gems. We're gonna have, like, 18 gems when I use, like, power up, but, like... Uh... Deal 25. Deal 4 to all. Deal attack plus 20 if the roll is greater than 5, which it will be, obviously, because we cheat. Um, I said we just start killing these. Oh my god, that's so much damage. Um, do we power charge, or do we just try to kill? I feel like we should maybe try stunning it. Because we could roll the crit, but like... No, that doesn't crit. Tempest! We have plus attack anyway. We gotta just go for the kill on one of them. If we just rush one down, then maybe our characters will live, so... Provoke! What a perfect skill! Provoke! <laughs> Sacrifice yourself for the greater good. Oh my god, that's so much damage and they cursed us. <laughs> Paralyze. Uh, that gets real cursed. Now they didn't roll high enough. Whatever. Um, This is a sea monster. Die, sea monster. It is weak to lightning. Good to know. Um, Cheat. Just cheat. <laughs> you can't survive me cheating, can you? <laughs> I think it's 328 health. How do I deal with that? Uh, can I stun it? Can I stun it? Oh my god, look at Para. Oh my god. <laughs> uh, add defense for a bunch of turns, yes. Just tank everything. Oh, thank god. Oh my god, she has zero health! Ah! <laughs> Everything's terrible! Ah, uh, Supreme Cell. Thank you. We should have bought more revives. Oh god, ah. Uh, keep cheating! Thank god you gave me the best character in the game for me. Thank you. Oh my god. <laughs> Do a bunch of damage if you know how to roll dice correctly. I'm like, I sure do. Oh, boy. Alrighty. Now we're doing A-OK. -okay. Um, we've already provoked, right? No, it's not. Whatever, just just gems. I, I need to up I need to up our gems and get this and then heal all. Oh my god, you killed them. Cure allies of everything except knockout. Thank you. That's, that's very nice. Ah... Uh, uh, this, that, into this, one, two, three, that's not great, but that's fine. Then we can revive a few. It's gonna like use water and kill all my party, isn't it? Nope. Oh, thank God, it's dumb. 
It doesn't know how to play. Good. Now we have tons of gems, we have attack up, we can kill it. Yes! I would again. <laughs> you fool! We have so many gems. One, two, three. Boy, you sure can't stop us cheating. Wait, this is 80. I don't have- oh, Can I stun it? No way the main things, like, we're- Usually for, like, the other boss, like, the limbs are weak for, like, the stun, but, like, the boss itself isn't weak to stun. So let's not waste an attack on it. Oh, I do so much damage. Oh, thank god we missed, too. It missed. That was gonna kill me, actually, wasn't it? That was gonna kill us. Oh my god. Uh, I really wish I had charge on so I could charge my gems faster. Thank you, Lottie. You're a valid member of the party. Uh, kill. One, two, three. Thank you for giving me the best character. Oh, it's so kind of you. Take so much damage. Should really cure that paralyze. What do you mean cure? You don't have anything on you. Add fire damage, hells yeah. Uh, generate, please. We need nothing but gems. One, two, three. Oh, we failed, oh my god. Still does tons of damage, but boy did we fail. Um, do I have to use anything? I don't think I have to use anything. Do we try stunning? I don't think stunning will work. That is so much damage it has. Uh, kill. Wait, I can, I can provoke, I can provoke, I can provoke. Kill this one instead! These ones are the damage dealers. That's a di that's water all! No, it's curse all, sorry. Is that a- That was a water all and curse all? What a crazy attack. Um, God, I need to just heal all. I like that, like, now we have the Crimson Maiden as our main damage dealer, just out of nowhere. One, two, three. Oh my god, we failed. I'm good at that roll, too. Um, I just have to charge for, like, a turn, don't I? Crit. Nice. Nice crit. Uh, let's just keep charging. Man, lowering my armor was a bad decision against this. What a horrible decision. <laughs> I definitely did significantly more armor. <laughs> da, 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 da. One, two, three. There we go. I roll so many tens. Ah, you don't even you don't even know. Ah, do I risk the roll? It's resistant to fire this turn. Let's risk it. One, two. Oh my god! <laughs> I suck at this game. What's this do? Uh, deal attack plus four, inflict death down. It's not, it doesn't need death down on it. We can kill with death down, actually. Yeah, we can kill with death down. Cheating. Magnificent. No matter how oh, we're, we're done. you assail the beast, it doesn't stop it from advancing toward the island. Your allies are fighting their hardest. And yet, it's still not enough. What do you mean? It's at 80 health. It's about to die this turn. Cannonball? A gigantic cannonball sails through the air. Oh my god. The monster's tentacles we already killed the tentacles, guys. Come on. Crunch. You see that a, ship? a single ship has fired the cannonball. There's no ships. And upon it, grief is at the helm. Oh my god, grief is Instructing the he has a ship. Islanders to fire shot after shot at the beast. Grief, you had a ship with a cannon on it? You don't have our home! We'll slay the monster! This isn't over yet. We can do this together. For Laddie, the villagers shout in unison. You feel your heart warm at those words. Uh, our friendship, our, our friends believe in us, which fills us you with strength. The villagers hated Laddie and wanted her gone. So why would they help you? <laughs> we just love Baron. We hate Laddie. <laughs> Regardless of the reason, you can't deny how heartened you feel. 
You and Laddie look at each other and nod. Oh, come on. I was about to kill this thing. You grip your sword with renewed strength, determined to cut through the threat, binding the aisle to its... Uh, I have to tell you, Le Livia is the, the actual damage to the here, Baron. Don't, don't tell you this. You're, the rest of your attacks. Are we fighting for where we're? Perfect. Oh, God, you killed us. Okay, Livia, I'm, go uh, I'm going to need you to kill this on this attack here. We're gonna need you to kill it. That'd be super cool of you. Okay, kill. One, two, three. There we go. Magnificent. Wait, that doesn't kill off of the over 80. Oh, cause, oh sorry, the minus 10. Yep, sorry, right, sorry. Right. We kill it. Take a bunch of fires and nines. That's a that's a weird number of gold. <laughs> oh, should learn guardian. That would have been nice to learn. Oh well. Oh well, we didn't need it. Who needs defense? Hey, uh, grief. Your sea monster was Together, very manageable. You managed to slay the calamitous beast, and watch as it sinks back into the sea. Uh, hey, Grieve, thanks for p participating and all, but we actually were about to kill it next turn, so Once thanks, Once you've buddy. celebrated your victory, you and your allies turn your ships in their respective directions and sail off. And then it came back out of the sea? Lithia and Galio, uh, Gladio. <laughs> Galio, G Gladio have left. Was that it? We're good? Uh, you fulfilled necessary requirements, uh, and unlock Island Eater's enemy story. Interesting. Oh, hi, Grief. How are you? Grief stands among the blooming flowers in the center of the village. Uh, turns out your problem that you, uh, just kind of consided yourself to, uh, sorry, conceded yourself, consided, consided, resided yourself to, uh, to being eaten by was actually super manageable by two people. So how about that, Grief? How about that? Grief hands his daughter a book. It's the same one that you found in his house. The diary of Laddie's mother. I thought we stole that earlier. Laddie We've already read it. Laddie opens it with an uneasy expression. Her eyes fill with tears as they pass over the words. The words? Who? Within its pages are words of love. A deep and heartfelt love that the previous maiden held for her daughter. <laughs> I really hope that like Grieve was like I had a fake diary made and the other one was filled with how much she hated you. <laughs> Just it the best of you. Contains words of anguish at having to burden her own child with the island's fate. Uh, again, I island's fate, uh, super easily manageable actually. Just got to keep rolling tense. Grief tells you that he refused to let Laddie sacrifice herself in the same way. I don't think the game accounts for you rolling, like, crits on every single one of your plus 20 attacks. It's, uh, it's, it's kind of, yeah, it was kind of really high. Your eyes widen in realization. So does that mean... What do I ask him? Uh, there isn't everyone scorned, Lottie. I don't know. <laughs> Grief tells you that a maiden's power comes from her heart. So everyone treated her cruelly in hopes of disheartening her. The... <laughs> That's the opposite of what you want, Grief. That's... Come on, buddy. I'm so sorry you had to endure that, he says. Deeply apologetic. What is the point of this? <laughs> they knew that if Laddie were freed from being a maiden, the island would be destroyed. It was... The monster was very easily manageable. <laughs> like, <laughs> you didn't have to, you didn't have to be like, oh, I guess we'll all kill ourselves in order to free Laddie. It's like, you could leave the island. <laughs> you, you had a boat. <laughs> but all the islanders wished to spare Laddie, even if it meant losing their homes and their lives. You, there's other islands. You, you, you didn't have to. It was all a lie. One that the village made Laddie believe for her own good. You were just mean to Laddie for no reason. <laughs> Laddie, now knowing Punch the him. depth of love that her parents love? and fellow islanders had for her. That was foolishness. Jumps into her father's arms 
and cries. That's a that's an insane plan, laddie. Don't don't believe his lies. <laughs> oh my god, laddie's speaking. It was so painful. It hurt so much. But I love everyone. For the first time, you hear it. The voice that Laddie buried deep within her heart. The voice of the cards! Da 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 da! <laughs> a soft breeze blows through the village. Like a gentle breeze upon this. the two of them. And carries countless petals into the sky. How nice. Laddie's innocent cries echo through the village amidst the drifting flower petals. So this village is insane, right? <laughs> They're like, ah, that we're, she's kind of, we're kind of sad that she has to endure the fate of being abated. Therefore, we will kill all of ourselves. And they're like, what? It's like, it's the only way to make Laddie happy is by killing everyone she knows and being super mean to her all of the time. And they're like, that's, that's the opposite of what she wants. I'm sorry, has Baron always been wearing like a really long like ribbon or like, tie? I, I've never known the that. ominous clouds that heralded the end give way to a bright blue sky. Is that like legit the final boss? That was actually really easy. Because <laughs> like the other final boss is like RNG hell in like the other game. Did they learn? Did they learn from the mistakes? I don't know if this is the end. The climate is beast, Fred is their home. The unexpected aid of two guardians to victory. Not them! What about the, the Crimson? The Crimson Maiden was the hero. After the battle, the village's long held secret is brought to light. You, secret? They're insane! <laughs> The village cruelty cold is towards the girl. The father who looked upon his daughter with disdain. Everything they did was to protect the young maiden. It really wasn't. If you just let her do this, she would have died on the island. <laughs> it was all a horrible lie woven for the love. No! The girl sobs joyously as her father arms echoing, Don't listen to them, laddie! <laughs> Tell of the mega village. Is, is there more? I don't know. Finn. They're all insane. Just all of them. What a terrible plan, by the way. <laughs> Petals dance in the uh, cloudless sky. I find my voice. The love of my family is uh, kept concealed. Love! <laughs> they purposely were being cruel to you and making you hate them. Uh, making you think they hated you. That's that's the literal meaning of gaslighting. <laughs> Laddie gained memories of family. I am your family, Laddie. Only I pride to protect you. Check out lack on the second floor. Wait, there's more game? Uh, grief side story, Laddie's mother. Fuck you guys, you're so. <laughs> Fuck you guys, man. You're horrible. <laughs> you guys suck. I never did find out what's on the other side of that mountain on this island. What an insane village these people are. What 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 reason of like, uh, uh, we're, we're trying to make you hate me so you won't miss us. It's like, what? You rush to the altar, worried about lack. Only to find it lazing atop the altar and yawning. Do you, do you also hate the, like, no hands, human nose, flower eyes, and horns this thing has, by the way? It has a wand, though. Is it Melody? When the self-proclaimed spirit notices you, it immediately changes its tune. Ow, oh, the pain. pain! It groans. But it's too late. I, why is it alive? Cheerful voice. Uh, cheerful voice being, obviously, uh, our person doesn't have voice here, so Lack! For the first time ever, Laddie calls out Lack's name and hugs it tightly, rubbing her cheek against it. We never got an explanation of what Lack is, right? Lack's expression reads of surprise, pain, and happiness from within Laddie's arms. It appears all your allies are together once again. Um, you decide okay. that it's time to venture back 
to the oh. heart's domain. <laughs> Was that not the final boss? And put an end to that giant shadow. Oh. I I forgot that we were expelled from this but world. You mustn't be hasty. Approach the altar only when you're ready. Um, do I have to fight it with Lack? Lack's, Lack's not my first choice here. Uh, once you're ready, head for the altar or something. Uh, let's just... Wait, don't we have like a thousand? We got like a billion uh, XP, right? Uh, I really should give her like def up because... Boy, do we have no defense on him. She doesn't really need any like normal damage, right? Let's do def up. I have to like roll this, sorry. Yep. Uh, plus 20 damage, I'll add 5 death for like a giant cost, or just 3. 3 is better. It's nice. Um, I like Flame Rush. Should I give her charge? I should, no, I don't need to give her charge. I'll, give, I'll make sure she has at least one attack that costs a bunch. She has double heal, she has normal heal. So, yeah, uh, super heal. Uh, that should be fine. Black, do you have any other abilities, by the way? No? Cool. You suck, buddy. I hate you. Uh, equipment. All good still? Do we have another frost mail? I, I might consider giving myself more armor. Like, we have to just, like, rush it with damage, obviously, but, like... Can we fuse all the other maiden swords into, like, a super sword? That'd be fun. That, that'd be super fun if we have, like, a super sword. Uh, save. I don't think I need any more revives. There's still plenty, right? I did use a few of them. We'll see. Oh, this is going to be the nonsense bosses. I'm going to buy a couple of vibes. This is 100% going to be like the RNG nonsense boss in this game. Uh, so let's let's go get some revives quickly. I was like, is this the end of the game? I couldn't tell you. Um... Do I buy Frostmail just in case it's better? It's almost not a bad choice. Uh, I can't decide. Can't decide. Bye. And I have so much money anyway, so. Da, 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 da. How many pansies do we have still? We have three. Uh, let's buy one more. Just in the off chance we somehow get killed by something. Uh, Omnipancia is actually not a terrible idea either. Let's, let's just do two Omnipancias. Um, Interpolix is what we wanted. Uh, let's have five. And are there any crazy items over here? Nope, smoke bomb. Alright, cool. Um, you lead the party back to your home. Oh, wait, what? Take a rest. You oh, this is the inn. Everyone inside, inviting them to rest their weary bones. I didn't realize we could rest in my house. I, I didn't, I didn't realize. Price should be full. Cool. I never noticed. Um, anything accessory shop? Do we want something to stop darkness? I feel like it's going to use a lot of darkness on us. We can get plus four armor because, like, he has so little armor. Like, we have fifteen. Um, I have a feeling it's going to use darkness, because it's the darkness of her heart. So, what if we just get, like, protection from darkness? A bunch. And we sacrifice some of our crit. Sounds good to me. Also, it gives us more attacks. So, like, that's, that's the perfect option. Uh, do we need protection from light? We get protection from light as well. So you don't really need crit, so let's keep you alive. So we have light and darkness. So white and black, obviously, that's our themes. Uh, I think we're good. I think we're good. Do I get frost mail, though? That's the only other question. I don't... Because the other boss was like almost one-shotting like a uh, Baron. And we, we can't have him like be one-shot. That's really problematic. Oh, they mentioned there was, like, a legendary, like, ore we could get to, like, make into a better, like, armor, right? We really should have done that quest. Um... Ugh. Ugh. Well, this gives plus four armor. Is that not what you're wearing? That's what you're currently wearing. Um... In case we want it, I don't have enough gold. Sell something. Here. 
Just in the off chance we need it. Um, do we have anything to sell? I, I feel like we do. Anything? Nope. Uh, sell some equipment. Can I just sell? I could just sell the old like. Can I sell their like old uh, weapons? That'd be really funny. I need to get two thousand if I was doing this though, right? Nah, I don't need to do this. This is not necessary. I guess we're not doing that armor. Oh well. Or I could kill like three monsters, but that's not necessary. We'll see how this boss is. If, if if I die to it, then we'll consider getting more stuff. But for now, I think we're okay. Okay, there, there's our actual preparation. <laughs> sea monster wasn't that scary, so. Ba -ba -da -da -da. I can't believe there's still more game after that. I thought for sure that would maybe be the final boss. It was kind of lackluster, but yeah. Okay. Uh, let's do a third save here. Just guess we want all our money back. And I say we go fight. Let's go fight the darkness in our heart. You turn to look at your allies and receive a stout nod from Laddie. Let's go, Laddie. Is she casting the spell? Laddie waves her staff oh my god, she, she's casting the spell. Showing off an excellent imitation of the self-proclaimed spirit. But when she sees your slack-jawed stare, she fidgets. I, I wanted, wanted to, to try, try once. it once. She confesses lack. His sole chance to shine stolen. Chance in a disheartened voice and leads you all to the heart's domain. Uh, not to be like, Laddie, have you always been able to speak? You find yourselves back in the land of woe's throne room. Now, it's time to put an end to that shadow. Imagine being such a dick to like the village maiden that like she like no longer wants to speak. And then going, it's for your good. It, we all hated you, so for your good. So the island would be destroyed, which you're on, by the way. And then you would be freed from the burden of being sacrificed as a maiden. To the sea monster. <laughs> I'll use bad weather. Uh, finish off the black shadow. Is it weak? What does it actually say? Um, our, our... Hirori, Hirori, love me. That one's love me. St I, I can't read this too fast. Um, hello. Would you like to fight? I, I wish to fight again. So you've made your decision, the queen says to Laddie in a defeated voice. I have. Laddie answers resolutely. Laddie's talking. Yeah. Having finally weathered the storms of her past. It seems the queen no longer has reason to resist. You decide it's time to finish off the dying shadow beside her. Is this just a story boss? Is this not an actual boss? This is a sad boss. That, that's a... That, oh my god, this is... It's a cool attack. It's a cool attack. Zero. Cool. Yeah, it's, it's worth nothing. Thank you. The shadow's true form is the unfulfilled desire in Laddie's heart. I will fulfill desire with my own words. Her part to play now over. The queen gazes upon Laddie with a serene expression. The relics in your and Laddie's hands radiate a dazzling light. And the final scar on Laddie's heart begins to heal. This is this is still the most Kingdom Hearts thing you've ever seen. Because it, it's Sora and Riku, like Sora and Riku fight together with the Keyblades. Come on! We're even the same color! With the final scar healed, Laddie's heart's domain has returned to normal at long last. That's good. Shall you and I go for a walk? Go on, get, Lack exclaims enthusiastically, and the both of you head off. How nice. Yeah, go away, Lack. 
We have the land of woe. Um. Can I? Oh my god, what? We have people in the place again. Ooh, can I talk to you? The queen tells you of a secret path at the rear of the castle. She says you can use it to leave the land of woe. Oh, cool. Um, I could just talk to you to leave? Sure. You decide to take the secret path and leave the land. It was a trap. We've killed you. <laughs> oh, how nice. Do I have a whole light world I now have to explore? Before your eyes stretches a pure and peaceful domain. How nice. The leaves rustle in the breeze and the waves gently ebb and flow. As if to show the peace that has come to Laddie's heart. You know, you could just give Laddie a nice life. Like, treated her nicely. Like, had her have, be super happy. And then have to sacrifice her at some point. Like, I, I think she'd have a much nicer life for that, how many teenage years she is alive. Or, I don't know how old Laddie is. But, like, she could have just a pleasant life for all of that time. And then you could sacrifice her. Like, you, or you could just be nice to her. You, like... <laughs> if the island's going to be destroyed anyway, why be dicks about it? Perched atop a new makes no hill, sense. Laddie beckons you over. Perhaps she wishes to give you a tour of her own heart. Do you know your own heart, Laddie? <laughs> like, I, I, it's not really called Zion Town anymore. Like, I've, it, it, it's kind of a happier. Where are we going, Laddie? Oh, Laddie. You can see white birds flying around the spire in the distance. Your eyes follow the birds until eventually nice. landing upon Laddie's <sighs> smile, and you reflect on your journey. Is, is the world eater thing going to come in here? The first time no? you came to this place, the entire world was cloaked in black, and Laddie couldn't utter a single word. Well, she apparently could, she just chose not to. Yeah. You were drawn from your thoughts when you feel Laddie tug on your sleeve. She says that there's still much more to see. This is so nice. Spoil the world with Laddie. Are there monsters in the map still? Probably not. I can just jump around. Beautiful trees line the restored forest. And butterflies float about as you stroll ba, ba, through, ba, ba, ba. admiring the greenery. A butterfly lands on Laddie's fingertip. As you watch her quietly rejoice, you think back on your travels. Yeah, it's nice to see Laddie smiling. When you visited the nearby town, your feelings toward Laddie were all while you're deep in thought. Laddie taps your shoulder. We should be getting back to Lack. She says with a smile. Is Lack the final boss? Because Lack's not a good name. That, that'd be funny. We try to leave Lack's well, like, no. You've come a long way. Would you like to go back now? Sure. Thank you. You hasten back to Lack's side in the land of woe. It's gonna pull a near, I mean, like, Lack's gonna be like the evil thing, right? I Because this game's just apparently not over yet. We just get like a nice happy story. Beneath the Done for happy story. A stained glass window. You and Laddie stand at the spirit side. Wait, didn't it say be prepared before you come here? There's nothing here. <laughs> Are you ready? Lack asks. Skip trolling me. <laughs> and Laddie in the throne room, where her desires once lurked in the shadows. Laddie bears her heart to you. Yeah, Lack's about to like attack this heart here, right? I... I love you. In a trembling whisper, Laddie makes a bold confession. It appears that over the course of your journey, she has developed feelings for you. No, no, really, Laddie? Was it perhaps because I'm the only person on your entire island who wasn't a horrible person to you? <laughs> and actually journeyed with you across the world to save your heart? I wonder why... <laughs> But having been born a sacrificial maiden, she suppressed those feelings, fearing they would only be a burden to you. Well, apparently you were never a sacrificial burden. Uh, sorry, sacrificial maiden. Because all of them wanted to die anyway. So, uh, congratulations, glad you're free. <laughs> it's supposed to say, 
Love you too, of course. I love Lottie. She's great. Lottie stares down at the ground as she awaits your answer. And you decide to respond to her confession that is in great. equal earnest. Come on, Lottie's great. She gazes up at you with wide eyes, as if disbelieving her own ears. You can see tears threatening to overflow in her eyes. I'm gonna be really like pissed off if it's faster to say no to Laddie in like a speedrun of this game. A transparent light begins to overflow from Laddie's staff. Ooh. It's as radiant as the glow from the maiden's relics. It's it's weird that we're still upgrading our weapons at supposedly the happy ending of the game. According to Lack. Now that her heart's domain has been restored, she can become a true maiden. Or, or hear me out, she could just not be a maiden and we don't kill Laddie, because I like Laddie. Would that be cool? With that, she can now save Omega Isle. We already saved Omega Isle. We, we, killed, we killed everyone. <laughs> they, they want to die. <laughs> not only do they want to die, we've already saved it from the horrible sea monster. Your journey's purpose fulfilled. You and Laddie look at each other with an ephemeral smile. But <laughs> I'm so confused. The world we made is full of light and my heart is full of love. Laddie gave memories of love. Finally, the world is how I wished for it. There's something there it is. about Lack's voice. There it is. And not just that. Cotton begins to spill out from its insides as it takes the form of a human. Oh my god, I can't believe that the puppet was a puppet. Is this not the most near twist you've ever heard? Something's not right. When you attempt to speak to Lack, you are struck by a tremor large enough to shake the world itself. Woo! The palace begins to crumble, and Lack is swallowed by the fissure that opens in the throne room. It is. It's nice to see there's another boss. Fingers graze hers as you try to grab her, but Laddie is just beyond your reach, and she tumbles into the abyss. I'll come back for you. I promise. I know. When you walk away, you don't hear me say, "Please, <laughs> oh baby, don't go." The heart's debate is Rome cloaked in black. There are more. The mirrored scars tell of girl's woe. Anguish born and made an unable to fulfill her duty. Sadness at being scorned by those she cared for most. Except me. I never scorned her. At journey's end, hope bloomed within her scattered, uh, scarred heart. The love that she had suppressed is realized at long last. I can't believe the puppet was a puppet. Clouds part, giving way to a beautiful realm. The tale of hearts debate. Only for it to be plunged in the darkness once more by the hands of a spirit called friend. I never called lack I, I never called lack a friend. I will go on record here saying I never could that's a that's a <laughs> that's actually a Kingdom Hearts world there. <laughs> Sir, that's that's actually a Kingdom Hearts world. You you can't the get us otherwise. The furious roiling seas have swallowed all but a small strip of land. It's still the going. Last vestige of a drowning heart, desperate for rescue. Ooh. The heart's domain is but a shadow of its former self. Devastated by the awesome power of the tsunami that nearly swallowed it whole. The face down cards are kind of nice, Black's actually. Transformation. The quake that threw you to your knees. Laddie, as the earth swallowed her. This is, like, not a surprise to anyone, right? Like, we, we all saw Lack being the villain, like, coming. Like, like sir, it's it. <laughs> it's, it's Yotaro. Like, come on, you have to know this is happening. You shake your head to free yourself from Yotaro. the following visions. What the hell's the guy's name? Laddie. You have to find Laddie. The we wind sure do. changes direction so abruptly. You can't help but feel it's telling you something. Urging you to the northwest. Well, I think there's only one way we can physically go, but yeah. Uh, adventure search for Laddie. Can I go south? What is south? There appears to be a south. What's south? Is south an option? 
Is, is this an option? This looks like there'd be treasure over here. Do I get reward for- Nope, I do not get reward for going the completely wrong way. Thank you. Anything over here? No? Alright, that, that seems that it's a plot moment. Excuse me. That's a tree. Sorry, I didn't think that looked like a tree. Let us go to these glowing cards. You stop before a gash in the earth filled with rushing muddied water. You see no way of crossing to the other side. I see. In an instant, a bridge appears over the surging rapids. You catch sight of a figure on the opposite side of the chasm. Is this their handiwork? I, I would believe so. And if you go here? A lone woman approaches you as you alight from the bridge. She bears more than a passing resemblance to Laddie. That would be a Laddie's mother if you if we if we didn't know. Hello, mother. How are you? The mysterious woman merely smiles in response to your query. At last she speaks. Her voice is soft and calm. She informs you that she is the former maiden of Omega Isle, which makes her Laddie's mother. Oh, wait, wait, beer, beer to the punch. <laughs> she studies you for a time. A sense of relief plays across her face as she whispers, Yes, I can trust you with her. Well, who else are you going to trust in the realm of darkness? The woman like... begins walking, slowly <laughs> enough that you believe she means for you to follow. Might she be leading you to Laddie? I would hope so. Unless she's the evil one, she's going to eat me, like, whole, but, like, yeah, that, that'd be awful. There, there, yeah, there's nothing in this world. What am I doing? Oh, that's a that's still a tree. That's still a tree. On we go. That's still a tree. That, 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 that one blended into the table for me, I'm sorry. There's a lot of trees in this place, huh? Mountain. Burdenburg. Is there anything down here? This keeps going. Oh, we're not going to Burdenburg. Speaks of her daughter as you walk down. Oh, you can totally road. buy stuff at Burdenburg, can't you? Laddie has long felt isolated. She says. I wonder why. Seated her mother, only to be driven from the village. I I wonder why. Traveling with you, however, taught her how to open up once more. You've saved my child. And I cannot thank you enough, she says with a warm smile. So we've completed Kingdom Hearts 1, and we're now going into Kingdom Hearts 2 now, right? Because this is clearly Nomine. We have to... So this is Chain of Memories. This is literally Chain of Memories now. Yay! So we have to go to the... the uh, uh, Castle Oblivion. Oh my god, we're just going through all of Kingdom Hearts. Of course we are. Though it may be to wander. Okay, we can't this go. Yep, gotcha, headed. thank you. Sorry, so you sorry. turn around. Sorry, game. I, I've got to make decisions. I'm sorry. Yes, we have actually reached the conclusion of Kingdom Hearts 1, so... Laddie's mother stops and extends a finger northward. Laddie cries out for your help from the spire, she says gravely. This is incredibly Kingdom Hearts, right? You see a it's clearly Castle Oblivion. Structure in the center of the heart's domain. You begin walking toward it, praying all the while that no harm has befallen Laddie. Head for the spire where Laddie's headed. Can I have... Can I have Laddie's mother as a party member? I feel like she would make a really good party member. I feel like she would. Stupid lack. I hate that guy. Well, it's a girl, but like, get that guy. Can I stop in Zion Town? No. Okay. Cool. Thanks. Sorry. Sorry. Anything up here? Nope. Anything over here? Nope. Anything over here? Seriously, no. Okay. Cool. Sorry, I asked. Is there anything up here? <gasps> nope. Sorry, I asked. Sorry. Sorry. You see a very familiar face when you arrive at the Spire Gate. Oh my God. I, I think I am going to get them as party members. 
Because he's, he's clearly the, uh, the, the guard, and this is clearly the maiden. Oh, thank goodness you've made it, Greeth says with no small amount of relief. Father? Yeah, we, we get them as party members. relief, however, is short-lived. Oh my god. You take notice of countless eyes peering at you from the shadows. Ah, oh, this is, this is gonna be fun. parents stand between you and the shadows. Oh, no, we don't get them. Press on ahead while they buy you time. So that would, that would be a cool story. To face the encroaching darkness. Shoulder to shoulder, they look like the many maidens and their attendants you've met along your journey. Yep, wish I could be my party. Tight with sorrow. You trust them to their task and fight your way into the spire. A twisted version of the spirit spire looms before you, emptied of the memories that's of a, your memories. That's many a weird visits. song. That's a that's a weird song. I have like whispers at the beginning. I love it. You hear a wail of anguish as you push the heavy door open. Was that Laddie? Yes, it must have been. Head to the source of the crying. It's all Laddie. right, Laddie. I'm here, you say in a soft, soothing voice. Are you the real Laddie? Are we in a virtual world? Laddie's gaze meets yours. Her anguished, fearful expression gives way to relief. Are you the nominee or the Kyrie of the story? The two of you embrace, as if trying to forget the short yet all too long time you were forced to spend apart. Second question, am I the Roxas or am I the Sora? Laddie's tears subside, and she regains her composure. You move to punish Lack for destroying the heart's domain, but Laddie takes firm hold of your sleeve. Even after all this, she seems to trust it, to believe there is more to its situation than meets the eye. Well, it, it, it's her inner heart, so it's, it's clearly something within her inner heart that's making her not want to be a maiden. Lack awaits atop the spire. Hoping to learn why it's doing this, the two of you journey upward. So just to be honest, this is a phenomenal ending, by the way. Like, this is great. Lottie's Omega Memorial transformed into Eternal Maiden's Relic. Thank you. Proceed through the Spirit Spire. Just get that, do that. Yep, gotcha. Enemy! Oh god, there's enemies! Okay, we, we can no longer just like, kind of mess around. There's a lot of enemies. All crit! Okay, never mind. Ow! Stop that. Ow! I have no armor. <laughs> oh my god. I should have bought armor. I, I, that is no armor, by the way. Uh, Tempest? I was about to be like, does that not kill? I'm like, no, it all crits. We're good. That's a... Yeah, I, I, I'm not healthy. <laughs> I I really should have gotten some more armor. Oh god, um, can I use a different... Can, can I use my other sword? It's only 14 armor, that's like, not even better. <laughs> um... Like, our, our, the attack is not the problem, I don't think, right now. It... Is there better armor? This is better armor, technically, right? Because it's plus six armor, but it's my stack. Okay, what if we... This is... This is plus one armor. It's plus four. This is minus two. So we, go for, so we go to minus three. And then we'd go plus two. Is that better? We, we would just do both. We would just get, like, nothing but, like, really high armor. It feels like the right choice, right? Is that the right choice? I don't know what the right choice is anymore. Oh, God. Um... Let's do sword. Protector sword, we're here to protect. And knight's armor. Knight. This is totally what we're supposed to do, right? Okay, because we have plus attack, then we have some armor, so we're not just getting killed by everything. Uh, because getting killed by basic enemies is kind of embarrassing. Um, I do not have a ton of healing items, do I? Mm. Mm. 
Not great. That's a waste, but let's go. Uh, was this the top or is this the top? This is the top, right? That is the top. I was going the right way, I remember. This is going maybe okay. Do I want the armor? I don't know if I want the armor. The altar is surrounded by four stela, each bearing the color and likeness of their respective maiden. I better not have to do a boss rush. You reflect on the friends you've made over the course of your journey. If only they were there by your side now. If only I had all of their weapons. Yep. As if responding if only. to your quiet summons, light issues forth from the stela and the maiden's relics. Please, God, give me a new weapon that like solves my armor problem. Of them live on in the heart's domain. Please fuse Perhaps until like. Perhaps they can aid you in your hour of need. Yes, please. All. First, the seal of the other attendants. Okay. Okay. Y yes, please. I, I really need this, actually. <laughs> oh, we can add them to our party. Um, who's the best party member? I think Crimson's the best party members, right? Yeah, because these two are the best party members, because then we have a tank. Then we can just actually focus on doing damage, right? Um, This feels like a, the correct choice now. So what if we just go full crazy person and like put on the damage again? Well, because she's the damage, actually, right? Yeah, the maiden's the damage if we do that. Is, is this, like, one of those... We, we, like... I feel like if we choose one of these, that's going to make us fight stuff, like, that we'd lose them. And that would really suck. So, let's just, let's just become as strong as possible here. Um, equip... Do we have anything that gets attack up? Because she's just nothing but attack, right? We could do dark stay. Uh, can I swipe this? Thank you. Uh, gemstone doesn't give anything. It gives no gemstone. Only at the beginning. This one has attack up, so that's not terrible. So we're just always critting with that. Um, you... Something that gives defense up, right? Uh, more health? Do I want, like, more armor? I don't know which one I want. We could do... Oh, we don't have the regen ring, do we? The regen ring would have been nice. Um... Ugh, hell for armor. Uh, health is temporary, armor is constant. There we go. It's constant damage reduction. Um, I think we're good. I think we're good. I, I'm the only kind of happy. With a faint light. Touching it might just send you back to the real world. I don't know what world I'm in anymore. <laughs> we keep swapping. Indeed, touching the altar plucks you from the heart's domain oh. and returns you to your own world. Laddie looks rather ill. You suppose you would too, if someone had been mucking about in your heart of hearts. She forces a smile are we, are and we tries fighting to it? act as though all is well. There is no time to waste. You must see to your business in the real world. Oh, and okay, this is how we leave. Heart's domain as soon as possible. I understand. Okay, cool. Well, you're right. Out of the light that swells from the altar, appear the maiden and her attendant. Oh, you just get them. That's cool. Or rather, illusions of them, born from Laddie's heart. But how are they here? How are they here? Could what's happening in Laddie's heart's domain be affecting the real world? What a crazy sentence. Um. Do we buy the other ring? I feel like the regen ring is not a terrible choice, but I don't think I have enough for it. Was it four? Was it eight thousand? Might have been eight thousand. Uh, go back to the heart's domain, Christian Mark. Was was I supposed to get to do? Yeah, I think I was supposed to get to do. Whoops. Yeah, I was supposed to get to do this way. I I trust my party. I totally trust my party. I've always trust my party. This is a significantly better party now. Fight him off. 
Uh, three gems at the beginning is correct, right? We need Laddie to be slower, I feel like. Um, sharpness to you or you? You. One, two, three, four. Four is still a three. How's that work? Um, Tempest is the better choice, right? Doesn't even kill them all. Oh my god. Uh, can we just run? What's the run? It's a two. Yeah, we don't need this. So these, these are nothing. We don't have to fight them. We need to fight the crazy war monsters. Uh, any legendary armor? Staircase. We have legendary armor. That'd be super cool. I like when paths just lead nowhere. It's nice. That's nice. Nice heal. Ow. Why do enemies get to move first? We're really fast. Come on. Uh, first of all, heal plus. And now run away. Seven? What the hell? Wait, wait, wait. Why is this a seven? The other one's way harder. One, two, three, four, five. <sighs> Fuck's sake. Seven's an impossible roll, by the way. Like, what the hell? I don't think I've ever seen seven. Uh, a lot of strong enemies here. Does this seriously not lead anywhere? Do you like that I brought the only alive maiden with us, by the way? Fight him off. How come they're outspeeding us? This is kind of ridiculous. Do I just do I just kill it? I could just kill it. But let's just kill it. Always a three. Always a three. Seal, whatever. Miss. Um, flame rush or air tempest. I'll just kill. Okay, that doesn't kill, which is mildly annoying. That does kill. Like, why is this a seven roll? Like, what? No damage. Like, it, it literally does no damage. Like, seven. Just seven roll. Um. Fire. Yeah, like, th th this is a thing that's really hard to run away from, guys. Like, really? How easy that was. Like, giant waste of time. Baron levels up. Nope, did just get skill. So he doesn't even get a skill. There's no point. Uh, we are very near the end of this game, I think, though. Let's keep going. Surely this will give me a final boss at some point, right? <laughs> I don't know. I'm sure I'll hit land. Like, this is a harder fight, by the way, it's a two. This is literally harder, and it's a two. What the hell? Uh, so we're going for the swamp. This is like a whole actual dungeon. What is going on here? You approach a young girl with Laddie's face. I hope I'll be a great maiden. She prays softly and That's repeatedly. Nice. That's nice. Uh, is there anything over here? I would love a legendary weapon. That'd be super cool. Dice roll by allies. Always land on five? Okay. What up? I've never seen that effect before. Not that one. Uh, this one... Five. Meet the fire. Interesting. Okay, they wasted the turns. Cool.
I really wish we'll have it. I could get rid of... Uh, do I want to get rid of Sharpness? Because I already have a buff on him. So if I gain two gems, I can do the other one. It's not a terrible idea. I could like just get rid of it and have like shards instead. Because she like her isn't really as useful as just doing the roll and getting gems. I'd rather risk it and get the gems, I think. But like again, she's the main damage dealer, so... I, I said we put the gems on. It's my vote. Definitely put the gems on. Um, where's charge? Um, I like defense. Uh, but she's she's not a damage dealer. We don't really need the light, right? Yeah, so here. So here, charge spell. Uh, do you like the all enemies and add defense? That's that's not worth it for double it. She doesn't need damage. She doesn't need to hear anything. She should be good. She's mostly here to buff, she's here to damage, she's here to, uh, he's here to defend, I'm here to damage. Okay. I being Baron, obviously. Go chest. Legendary weapon. Um, whatever, that's fine. I would love a legendary weapon, that'd be cool, but whatever. We'll take what we can get. That's a lot of laddies. You approach a young girl with laddie's face. As long as I can protect those I care about most, all will be well, she says, grinning from ear to ear. I can't tell if this is going to be like an entire dungeon. If it's going to be an entire dungeon, this might take a while. <laughs> the final boss also might take a while. Um, yeah, see, I like this better, because then we can just charge spell. Then everyone else has like a lot of fixed like use. Um, because then we can Air Tempest. Well, not Air Tempest, the other one, which is Whirlwind. Now that I failed my roll, we can, uh, leave. Get plus four fire to all. See, that's not terrible. Five? What the hell? <laughs> Sorry, I have to do a better roll here. I think that times two damage is just nothing. One, two, three. Three? That's seriously a three? One, two, three. There we go. Um, I don't know if this is going to be the end of the game or not. So this is like a whole dungeon. This might take a while and the boss might take a while. Uh, so I'm going to pause it here. And if it is the final way, I might just tap it on to end the video. And if not, it'll be a whole nother episode. So remember guys, if you've, been enjoying the, if you've been enjoying this, make sure to subscribe to the channel, do it with interactions. I'll see y'all maybe in a second or maybe later. Maybe bye? <laughs>